Three-time Grammy Award-winning songwriter, composer, and musician William Salter is the mastermind behind songs that have been passed through generations like this one. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try. And now, the two of them, Salter and his granddaughter Jada, are spreading the word about a documentary she's planning to produce about his legacy entitled Just the Two of Us. I've like been his biggest fan since I was a kid, and I thought I just thought it was always cool that he was a, a songwriter and, you know, kind of behind the scenes. I mainly want to focus on his story and, you know, how he came from Harlem and, let's say, out of poverty, right? And he... He built his way up. This is a, a spectacular situation for me because it's sort of like a who knew situation. I mean, I was living my life going along, doing all the things I was doing. And all of a sudden, this lady comes out of the closet, so to speak, and bam, here I am. Jada, who's finishing up her final year of film school, actually first learned of her grandfather's signature song from the Will Smith remake. From the first time the doctor placed you in my arms. I... That was the first version I heard, and my grandfather would show me the book that Will Smith did, so I would love to see him, and I would love to interview him or speak with him. Um, if we can get him on board, that would be amazing. Jada and her dad, Jamal, Salter's son, hope to get musicians past and present involved in the film. Even through like the 80s, 90s, and today, there are still a lot of uh, R&B artists, pop artists, dance artists, uh, uh, hip hop artists that have covered his music. We all believe that this will be a great project and a great thing to show the world that, that the one thing that doesn't leave is the spirit of music. And that's why it's called Just the Two of Us because it has to do with the soul of you plus the creative part of you. Salter, who is now 84 years old or 84 years young as the family puts it, is itching to perform once the pandemic ends. He used to play bass for singer Harry Belafonte and South African singer Miriam Makiba. He says his path was not planned growing up. But when I got to the music class, the only all your instruments were taken except three string basses standing against the wall. But there's a lesson to be learned. We all bring something here. I mean, as we are brought here, do something, right? Do you. And uh, this turned out to be me. New material may be released for the film, but for now, Jada and her classmates have a goal of raising $20,000 to cover equipment and travel to share the story of the two of us with the world. This is Inside Edition Digital.